All right, so go through it again. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. No! <laughs> Best seed ever. It's unboxing time from our friends over at WizKids, uh, and they lovely, lovely, wonderfully, 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 that is the word. They awesomely sent us this awesome box of awesome stuff in the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two, uh, Gravity Feet. We haven't been told whether this is hobby or mass market. Mass market. So we're, we're gonna find out. Best guess, most likeliness, a hobby box. Yeah. And Yondu is a hobby? Um, Star-Lord, I believe, is the chase for hobby? Is Star-Lord the chase? I thought Nebula in it. All right, you know what? Let's open it and find out what we get. <laughs> How does that sound? Oh, man. <laughs> We're sitting here speculating. People are like, open the box already! <laughs> all right. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Oh, it's been a while since we had one of these! <laughs> and it didn't go on my head! Uh, we risk too many figures when we do that. All right, grab your 12. Hurry up. <laughs> People don't want to hear this noise. Five, 10, 11, 12. I think that's 12. Um, I'm bad at counting, so. Nope, it's not, because I have 12. Unless the game is 25. That would no, be totally I awesome. I just missed something. All right, All right. Racer. Oh no, oh, she beat me. I got a Star Lord. He has 12% of a plan. Star Lord. Star Lord. <laughs> Star Lord can use leadership and outwit. When he rolls a critical hit, he can use outwit two times. Two more times this turn. So, possible three times in a turn outwit, which is going to be super potent once we move into the new outwit rules. I love the set symbol for this is like a cassette tape. For those of you born before a certain time, a cassette tape is what we used to listen to music on. Oh my God. And at times, your music would break because it would get tangled. <laughs> All right, I got Kraglin. Uh, he's got a trait. Carry out his orders, ya bums. If Jason friendly characters that are either equal or less points or have the Ravager's keyword can use willpower. Interesting. Uh, he comes in at 50 points, so neat old little figure there. All right, Craglin. I don't know why I went to a British voice for him. It seemed like the most natural thing. What do you got? I have a Sovereign. A sovereign. He's a pilot with a keyword or real name Various. Oh, uh, so he's a generic. Yeah. He has a uh, special defense power, density reassignment. Sovereign can use toughness and willpower. When he has one action token, he can use invulnerability. When he has two action tokens, he can use impervious. I'm not going to lie to you. He's not indomitable. He can be played at either 80 or 25 points. I should point out that the 25 point uh, dial has support. Cool. Um, so I just pulled the most adorable thing ever created. Uh, oh, is it, it is a rocket and Groot. <gasps> oh my gosh. That oh, is so adorable. So cute. All uh, right. So what do we got here? Oh, cool. Okay. So, trait, I am Groot. <laughs> Give Rocket and Groot a free action to place adjacent a Groot Twig bystander if there's not already one on the map. They're reversing the con. <laughs> Rocket, uh, if Groot if Groot Twig is KO'd, you may not place any Groot Twig bystanders for the rest of the game, and Rocket and Groot modify their combat values by plus one and can use Precision Strike this game. If Rocket and Groot are KO'd, you may place a Groot Twig bystander in the square they last occupied if there's not already one on the map, and modify that character's combat values by plus one this game. <laughs> it ignores characters for movement, and the Groot Twig has plasticity, is tiny, has poison, uh, and enhancement. And let's go for a ride is its trait at the beginning of your turn, and if you began the turn on the map, you may remove Groot Twig from the map if he's adjacent to a friendly rocket and Groot. That's a, a pretty reasonable dial. 70 points on this little duo. That is totally so, so cool. Oh my gosh. Oh man. Look at that. And we'll just give you a couple seconds there, and then I'll show you the rocket Groot Twig. Of course, as usual, I'll take these through 
the ringer and review them for the competitive versus casual market um and go from there all right amber what do you got now uh unfortunately i have to follow that up with the ravager <laughs> who is a generic uh with the ravager pilot and pirate keywords uh, who is a trait? A pirate's life for me! Yar! During force construction, you may pay 20 points for this character. If you do at the beginning of the game, choose a starting line. During force construction, you may pen pay 10 points each for up to four of this character. If you do at the beginning of the game, an opponent must choose a distinct starting line for this. So it's kind of like the Morlock, mm -hmm. where he has four different starting lines. Uh, he does have an attack power, taking prisoners. When Ravager hits with an attack, after actions resolve, give the hit character an action token. Interesting. So I got Gamora, figure number 006. Uh, this is just a character with really good stats. It's, uh, she's a very basic character, 65 points. Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, Martial Arts, and Warrior keywords. You're just going to throw everything on the ground, yep. aren't you? Uh, and, yeah, really good stats for reasonable point value. I mean, I'm just going to go straight to the dial... As far or the card back for for you guys because really that's what's going on there. Uh, all that's going on. Uh, I got another sovereign. So. <laughs> all right, let's see if I can keep the flow going. Oh, I got Groot. Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy cosmic keywords. I am Groot is his trait. Groot, can you sidestep? Trade a sidestep. Friendly characters within one square can use Ignore's elevated terrain. Hmm. Uh, and then he's got Heart of the Team as a special damage power. Groot can use Enhancement and Shape Change. He's only three clicks long, 30 points. Uh, yeah, very cool. And Ignore's hindering for movement. He's, he is oh so little. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, I think he'll get lost. I thought, I thought Tippy Toe was small. But <laughs> yeah. this, no, this, this is... is like tiny. <laughs> yeah, he's tiny. such a little guy. I don't know if you guys can see him. He's tiny. Yeah, we're gonna give you a quick close up. Like it is ridiculously small, and I can't even get the focus to work on it properly. Oh no. Yeah, it's super small. <laughs> there you go. Okay, I got another Ravager. So <laughs> You're pulling the doubles today, eh? It's 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 all like it's I got another. I mean, it's gonna happen lane, so. with a box like this. You yeah. tend to get uh, a double of all the the commons. Yeah. So I got another Craglin, if you want to... <laughs> Try to get something different? Yeah. Um, I got another Rocketing Groot. Okay. So, with the, with the way these boxes are designed, um, these particular Gravity Feed ones, uh, you will get a lot of doubles out of it. So, yeah. that's just gonna happen. I got another Star-Lord, so, uh, same one that you pulled. Okay. I got a Mantis! Mantis, cool! Uh, her... She, her antenna are kind of just painted on her hair, not rather actually being on her hair. Um, she has no special powers, so we're just going to show you the dial on that, but she does have uh, improved movement, ignore hindering. So, we'll get you seeing Mantis here. Sorry guys, I'm talking to my daughter behind <laughs> the camera. <laughs> Alright, uh, I got Drax, who we've seen preview, uh, but for those of you who haven't seen the preview, He's got a trait, the Path of Vengeance. Drax can use a Colossal Stamina ability, modifies combat values by plus one for each action token on him. When he clears action tokens, you may heal him one click. Uh, and then he's got special damage power. If an opposing character is within line of fire, Drax can use Battle Fury. Uh, and he has that Battle Fury on all but his first click. Uh, he's indomitable, set of points. There we go. Alrighty, so to make up for all of those doubles and generics I was pulling, I pulled the chase. Uh, Nebula. And it is Nebula, so I do believe that does make this the mass market box. I don't know still. <laughs> um, so anyways, Nebula has a trait. Nebula can use Blade's Claws Fangs. When she does, she may roll in, may instead roll 2d6 and choose one as a result. Uh, she also has special movement. Uh, can use charge and flurry, and she ignores characters for movement. Um, she's looking a lot like Yondu in this picture, though. <laughs> I got another Gamora, so that's really more exciting than <laughs> what I pulled. Uh, I think we need another, which Gamora is another of the same Gamora? All right, so All right. that's our triple of. I got a rocket. Rocket on his own. Uh. 
He's got a defense power called Stay Still, Your Vermin. Uh, Rocket can use Mastermind and Super Senses. He can use Mastermind regardless of point value if the friendly character shares a keyword with Rocket, which is pretty much what we're going to see Mastermind happen anyways going forward with the new rules uh, this summer. He can ignore uh, hindering and characters for movement. For movement? Yeah. Oh, okay. Not yeah, not for not for line of fire. It's Weird. for movement, okay. which is rather different when looking at Rocket. He usually gets that sort of thing for uh, shooting. I got another group. <laughs> another group. Oh my goodness! All the groups. <laughs> I got another Rocket. All right. Um. All right. Uh, I got another Drax. I got another Mantis. All right, well, you got okay, to pull off the last edge here. one, it's probably a double, unless it's something we have not seen yet. Um, and it is a Star-Lord. Yep. All right. So, there so we're going to go through the collection in the next episode, where I go figure by figure, and discuss uh, how good they are in the, the respective games that they belong in. All righty. Thank you once again to Wizkits for providing us with this box. It was really awesome to uh, get the first look at Guardians of the Galaxy. And I really can't wait to try that Rocket and Groot combo. <laughs> They're so cute. All right, guys. Have a good one.